What's up, y'all? It's me, it's Mel with the lipstick app. Mel, the lipstick diva. The lipstick diva. Ooh, yeah. What's up, y'all? Y'all know this about to be deep if I got my cup up here. Like, I got ice all over my cup. Ooh, ain't nothing but a little hen dog and a little lemonade. Mm hmm. That's what's really good. Anyway, let me get straight to it. Today's video is in reference to Liliana Brown. It may be Liliana or maybe Eliana, due to other YouTubers I've watched because I've been researching this all day. Um, I first seen it this morning on one of the YouTube pages that I'm following on Facebook. One of the um, YouTubers that are like trying to build up their page was like, this girl lied about being pregnant and homeless. Yes, pregnant and homeless. Um, and on top of that, being a teen mom already. So, of course, you know, people are going to see this topic and feel sad. But I had to dig a little deeper because... Um, what I did first is I went to watch her video. She apologized, which I will put the video below. She apologized for lying to everyone about being homeless, sleeping in her car, being a single mother, and even faking a pregnancy um, because it was allegedly said that she was pregnant with twins. I didn't go watch the video where she was talking about she was pregnant, but I saw the thumbnail for it. So I'm like, oh, okay, oh girl, I was going deep into this. Anyways, let me tell you how the story. So I went to watch her video and she was talking about how she apologized. The video that she was doing with the 24 hour sleep in your car challenge, that's all it was supposed to be. But she said it ended up, um, she just went ahead and started doing videos on actually being homeless because she wanted to get viewers, she wanted to get um, subscribers because she said she started her channel before but she was working full time so she really couldn't give her channel her all girl I work full time and I make these videos when I want just to throw that tidbit out here now let me just say this I am not mad at what she did because she got it how she lived because baby got 42k she got 42k subscribers right now and the views went up like I mean, hey, she was being an actor. She went for what she wanted. And also, um, I found from another YouTuber's video that was talking about the situation that this girl named Liv's life. And I'll put the video below too. She pretty much was bigging up the girl like, oh my God, this girl, her baby's cute. She's homeless, da da da, da. So of course, this girl got 80K subscribers. So her subscribers going to this girl, Eliana, Liliana, Finesiana, whatever. They're going to her channel, you know, seeing what's up. And just, I know I'm bouncing back and forth. But anyway, Liliana in her video, she talked about how people sent her cash apps and she declined and she was putting up screenshots how she didn't take the money. People were sending her like a hundred dollars. Um, I wouldn't have sent y'all back y'all money. If I'm a finesse, I'm a finesse all the way. You feel me? <laughs> which is not me like anything i put on my channel that's real life because i don't know y'all i don't have a reason to lie to y'all and i'd rather have a slow grind than no grind at all i really want youtube to be something that blows up for me but trust me i'm not finna lie to y'all about nothing hop on the wave and talk about a topic yeah i'll do that but lie about my own life talking about i'm homeless living in the car no because god can take everything away from you i just want to point that out anyway to me and the girl apology video, I don't feel like she was sincere. I don't feel like she was really sorry. It was more so get up off my back because if you go to her channel, all her comments are turned off. So that means she a little afraid of what y'all gotta say. She don't wanna see the negativity, which I get it because being a YouTuber, you can get discouraged by so many trolls and people just in the comments telling what you should and you should not be doing, which you know what, F y'all, F y'all trolls because I don't give a damn about y'all. Y'all not gonna be here to sign this check when I get that check. The first check may not be big, but baby, I'm gonna get one. Know that, I'm on my way, but still subscribe to my channel, uh, but yeah. 
I don't feel bad for her. I don't feel like she was really sorry. I feel like she she pulled a, a Q, what was her name? Q, Eat With Q or whatever. I think she pulled one of her moves because when Eat With Q bash B-Love, she really wasn't remorseful. She really didn't care. She didn't want to keep losing subscribers because Baby lost a lot of subscribers. Now this girl Liliana, I feel like even though she lied about being a single, homeless, pregnant mother living in her car, they're going to keep coming back because they want to see what she's talking about. They want to find out what her channel is about. Like her last video, it didn't make any sense. She had some big ass papers on her eyes trying to be fake eyelashes. It seemed like she was mocking someone that snitched on her or whatever the case may be. And that's what led me to Liv's life channel, Real Talk, because it was said that she was saying Liv's life um, snitched on her. But in reality, Liv's life was just saying, nah, I sent my traffic to your channel. That's how you blew up a little bit. She was trying to be on some Janelle stuff. Y'all know how Janelle came out? Excuse me. Y'all know how Janelle came out? She's a young girl living in a van. She actually living her life, I think. Now, would Janelle ever come out and be like, I really don't live in my van? I'm like, well, it was entertaining while it lasted. You and your pet snake, you traveling around the country. It's all for entertainment. Some of us up here, real life, like me, I talked about my bankruptcy. I talked about my abortion. And some of us up here faking the motherfucking funk to get those subscribers real quick. And I am mad at you. Keep doing your thing. Keep your hustle up. But y'all, check out her video. I don't think she was sorry. Y'all give me y'all comments below and tell me how y'all think y'all feel. And also watch her other videos where she talked about she was homeless. Like, I watch a part of one when she was at a gas station. She had went to McDonald's um, and she was just talking about how people were asking her, well, where's your stuff? And she was like, well, obviously it's in my trunk. Like, girl, your car was too goddamn clean for to be homeless. So I don't want to hit it out of my face. Anyway, shout out to you, Finesiana. Y'all know who it is. It's me. It's Mel with the Lip and Gap. I got to go to bed because I got to go to work in the morning. But y'all like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and tell a friend to tell a friend. Peace out.